So Nano Banana Pro is Google's newest AI image model, and it's the most advanced we've seen yet. And in today's video, I'm gonna show you exactly how it works and how I generated some of these amazing images. Just check these out. Now what's really impressive about the new Nano Banana Pro is how well it handles text rendering. It's honestly out of this world. Back in the days when AI first came out, it was pretty much impossible to tell it what to write in a text. But now the AI understands completely what you want and you can add your own text to labels, product shots, car commercials, whatever you want, you can add your own text to the shot and the AI is gonna understand how you want to implement the text. I've prepared a list of prompts and I'd love to share this list with you. All you have to do is just leave a comment down below and let us know what you found most valuable in this video. And by the way, guys, I also wanted to mention that Artlist is right now hosting a massive holiday sale. Right now, you can get 40% off the annual AI plans and 20% off the Max Pro annual plan. Check it out over at Artlist. Now, what's really amazing about this list is you can take some of these prompts, paste them into ChatGPT and tell ChatGPT to transform it over to your own idea. And you can transform it over to any idea you have. If you guys wanna learn more about AI filmmaking and AI photography, please consider subscribing and hit that bell to get notified and always stay updated. So today we're gonna to test out some awesome ideas and concepts, things like car commercials, product shots, pretty much anything you can think of. And we're also gonna test out some very abstract ideas to see what Nano Banana Pro is truly capable of. So here we have one of my prompts and we're just gonna copy this over to Artlist. So let me head over to the text to image feature using the Nano Banana Pro model. So as we can see here, the prompt defines an ultra realistic cinematic photograph of a whiskey bottle placed on a dark rocky surface inside of a cave. And we then also have some info on the label. It reads whiskey on the rocks behind the bottle. We have a glowing lava waterfall and so on. You guys get the idea. And our list actually also has this enhanced feature. So you could easily just type in a simple prompt and then use this enhanced feature to spice it up. So we're gonna make sure this is set to 16 by nine. You could also do portrait or square, but we're gonna use landscape for this one. And we're gonna click on generate. And there we go, guys. That looks amazing. And it actually also did add in the text that we wrote in the prompt. So we have some lens flares going on. And we also have the lava flowing in the background here. It looks like it did mess up the text here a bit. So we might have to iterate that. But what we can do is we can go ahead and save this image. We can then drag that image back into Nano Banana Pro and let's add some adjustments. On the whiskey bottle label, there should be a text that says Artlist Holiday Sale and a smaller text that says Alcohol 40%. All right, guys, so here's the new generated image. And as you can see, it has added the text Artlist Holiday Sale. And it's also added the alcohol 40%, even though it doesn't look perfect. But let's try and use the upscale feature and see how that looks. So it's definitely better, but it's still not perfect. Learning how to prompt and generate your ideas with AI definitely requires a bit of a different approach. You gotta learn to think like a filmmaker and to put your ideas down on text is definitely a bit challenging. You really gotta learn how to transform your creative ideas into text and apply them over to prompts. What type of lens is used? What kind of lighting is there in the scene? Where's the subject placed? How's the texture of the surface? All these details matter because the more information you give the AI, the better it's gonna understand your concept and ideas. Now over at Artlist, they also got access to the newest AI video models, such as Sora 2, VO3, and Kling Turbo. And besides that, they also have a massive library of sound effects, music, LUTs, and stock footage. Now, even though some of these AI tools are really amazing, they're definitely not a magic solution. I drink my beer where I want, when I want. They still require a ton of work to get the exact visuals you're going for. And you really gotta learn to think as a filmmaker and provide the AI with as many details as possible. So this is what I really love about Nano Banana. Not only can you generate an image from a text prompt, but you can also generate image to image, which means you can input an image and you can make any changes to it. Look how effortless you can change anything from the text to the subject. It's really amazing how well it understands whatever changes you're trying to make to the image. I simply told Nano Banana to add text to the side of the truck that states Artlist Holiday Sale. You can literally change the background for your product or even place yourself in different locations with a single prompt. Just check out how amazing the product consistency is. I also wanted to show you some of the amazing videos I've generated with Sora 2, VO3 and Kling Turbo. Check out some of these videos.
crazy, right? Anyways, go check out that holiday sale. You can find the link in the description down below. Now for all of these amazing AI image generations, I've simply taken one of the prompts from the list and sent it over to ChatGPT. I've then told ChatGPT to use the prompt as a reference to generate random creative ideas. Now with this approach, ChatGPT is going to create the prompts for us and I can simply generate multiple cinematic images with almost zero effort. Now let's go ahead and animate some of these amazing, awesome AI generated images using the newest AI video models available over at Artlist. Let me show you exactly how it works. It's actually really simple. All you have to do is select one of the AI images and click on animate. You can then choose between multiple AI video models. I really like VO 3.1 fast because the quality is simply amazing and it's also way less expensive in credits compared to AI video models such as Sora 2 Pro. So I'm going to type in a prompt, the camera pushes in on the whiskey bottle as the F1 race cars drive by. And that looks awesome. But I really want the camera to zoom in on the bottle. So instead of using the words push in, we can type the camera zooms in on the bottle. And there we go. Just by adjusting the prompt a tiny bit, we can help the AI understand exactly what we're trying to achieve. Now for this one, I wanted to try something crazy. Here's my prompt. The car transforms into a futuristic plane and flies through the lava environment. The camera follows the plane in FPV drone style video. And here's another one where I typed in this prompt. The two rabbits look at the truck as it drives by. And for this one, I typed the camera follows the car like we see in a cinematic high-end car commercial. And with this close-up shot of a watch, I got some really strange results. But that's how it is with AI. You gotta be very specific in your prompts to get the results you're going for. So yeah, the hardest part about working with AI visuals is not generating them, but learning how to transform your creative ideas into prompts. And you also gotta learn how the AI works and how it understands prompts. Because if you don't tell the AI in your prompts, it's just gonna guess, and then it's no longer your visual, it's no longer your idea, and you're pretty much out of control. But to have full control, you really gotta tell the AI every single specific detail. Do we need lens flares? Do we need volumetric fog? Whatever is needed, you gotta tell the AI as much information as absolutely possible. Anyways, go check out that holiday sale. Right now, you can get 40% off the annual AI plans and 20% off the Max Pro annual plan. So head over to Artlist by using the link in the description down below and start creating without limits.